Yo, it's your guy, Dr. Cool. From the heart of Zimbabwe, a technological earthquake has erupted, sending tremors across the global energy landscape. Maxwell Chikambutso, a visionary inventor, has unveiled a suite of self-powered technologies poised to redefine our relationship with energy. Imagine a world where electric vehicles, motorbikes, and even entire homes draw power not from fossil fuels or batteries, but from a seemingly limitless source harnessed by Chikumbutso's inventions. This is not science fiction. This is the dawn of a new energy paradigm, one where the limitations of traditional power generation and distribution could become relics of the past. Chikumbutso's technology, shrouded in a degree of secrecy, reportedly taps into previously unknown energy sources, eliminating the need for external charging or refueling. This breakthrough has profound implications for industries ranging from transportation to manufacturing, potentially democratizing access to clean energy on an unprecedented scale. The ramifications of this innovation extend far beyond mere technological advancement. This is a geopolitical game-changer, one with the potential to reshape the balance of power on the world stage. The emergence of self-powered technology throws into sharp relief the existing power dynamics of the global energy market. For decades nations have risen and fallen on the strength of their fossil fuel reserves, control over oil in particular has fueled conflicts, propped up dictatorships and driven the global economy. The prospect of a world unshackled from this dependence represents both a promise and a threat, a future where energy independence is within reach but where the established order is at risk of crumbling. The world watches with bated breath as this new energy era dawns. What if the next big breakthrough in energy didn't come from a Silicon Valley lab? but from a workshop in Zimbabwe, Africa. Imagine a car that never needs charging, unlike Tesla or internal combustion engine cars powered by fuel. These new cars and a racing motorbike are being powered by something called microsonic energy. This is the reality of Zimbabwe-born inventor, Maxwell Chikumbutso, a 44-year-old man and a high school dropout. The, 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 the vehicle it uses what we call the microsonic energy device. Microsonic energy device, which is the, the device that I personally invented in 2009, which harnesses radio frequencies converted it into energy. As you know, radio frequencies they are measured in nano volts, meaning to say they are less than a volt. They are just like nothing. But we find a way of harnessing it through the 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 creation of uh, the 70 percent of the components in the microsonic energy, which I tell me to design it. So with this car, you can also use it to power your house. It is a moving generator. When you drive from work uh, back to your home, you can connect your power cable, then you can power your house. It, is, it gives you 15 kilowatts uh, power to power your house. The Microsonic Energy Powered Vehicles and Motorbike will officially be launched by the President of Zimbabwe on February 10th, 2025. This car's promise an unlimited driving range top speeds of up to 220 kilometers per hour, and the ability to power your home just like a Tesla, all without ever having the need for even just a single charge. Will this be a future of shared prosperity, where access to clean and abundant energy fuels global development? Or will it be a future marred by conflict, as those who have long benefited from the status quo fight tooth and nail to maintain their grip on power? The answers to these questions lie in the responses of the world's most powerful nations, particularly the United States and China. The United States, long accustomed to dictating the terms of the global order, finds itself at a crossroads. Chikumbutso's self-powered technology directly challenges the very foundations of American economic and geopolitical power. The U.S. economy, heavily reliant on its energy sector and its dominance in the global oil market, faces an existential threat from the widespread adoption of this technology. The petrodollar system, a cornerstone of American economic hegemony, could crumble, leading to a decline in the dollar's global reserve currency status and a potential economic crisis. Faced with such a disruption, the American Leviathan is likely to resort to its familiar playbook suppression and control. Expect a multi-pronged strategy aimed at discrediting, containing and ultimately controlling this disruptive technology. Economic pressure on Zimbabwe through sanctions, financial incentives to halt the technology's development and even corporate sabotage is all but guaranteed. The specter of military intervention, whether through covert operations or support for regime change, looms large, particularly if the U.S. perceives a threat to its national security interests. The U.S. government, in concert with its allies and powerful corporate interests, will likely attempt to control the narrative surrounding self-powered technology. Expect a wave of misinformation, casting doubt on the technology's viability, safety, and environmental impact. 
regulatory roadblocks will be erected, stifling innovation and slowing down the technology's adoption, patent disputes, legal challenges and accusations of intellectual property theft will be deployed to bog down the technology in a quagmire of litigation. The United States faces a stark choice, adapt or resist. Embracing self-powered technology would require a fundamental restructuring of its economy and a relinquishing of its grip on the global energy market. Resisting this change, however, risks leaving the U.S. behind in the race for the future, ceding technological and economic dominance to rivals eager to capitalize on this paradigm shift. The potential economic crisis triggered by the widespread adoption of self-powered technology could be unlike anything the United States has experienced before. The petrodollar system, which has underpinned American economic dominance for decades, could collapse as demand for oil plummets. This would devalue the dollar potentially leading to hyperinflation, a loss of purchasing power, and a decline in living standards. The ripple effects of this economic earthquake would be felt far and wide. Major oil companies, auto manufacturers heavily invested in traditional combustion engines, and the vast network of industries reliant on fossil fuels would face bankruptcy and collapse. Millions of jobs would be lost, leading to social unrest and political instability, the United States' global standing already in decline would be further eroded as its economic might wanes. The very fabric of American society built on a foundation of cheap and abundant energy would be shaken to its core. The American dream, with its promise of upward mobility and material prosperity, could become unattainable for many. The social contract between the government and the governed, already frayed by economic inequality and political polarization, could unravel entirely. This scenario, while dire, is not inevitable. The United States still possesses the resources, ingenuity and capacity for reinvention to navigate this challenging transition. However, doing so would require a radical departure from the current course, a willingness to embrace change, and a commitment to investing in a more sustainable and equitable future. The question remains, is the United States up to the task? In stark contrast to the US's likely resistance, China, the world's emerging superpower, is poised to embrace self-powered technology with open arms. China recognizes this technology's disruptive potential, not as a threat, but as an unprecedented opportunity to leapfrog the West and establish itself as the global leader in the new energy economy. Unlike the US, which is deeply entrenched in its existing energy infrastructure, China, with its centralized planning and state-controlled economy, is well-positioned to adapt rapidly and effectively. Expect to see China pouring massive resources into research and development, partnering with Chikumbutso and other innovators to refine and scale up self-powered technology. China's vast manufacturing capacity will be swiftly retooled to mass-produce self-powered vehicles, generators, and other devices, flooding both domestic and international markets. This rapid adoption will drive down costs making self-powered technology accessible to a global consumer base eager to break free from fossil fuel dependence. China's embrace of self-powered technology is not merely an economic calculation, it's also a geopolitical strategy. By becoming the leading provider of this revolutionary technology, China can curry favor with nations around the world, particularly in the developing world, hungry for energy independence. This soft power play has the potential to reshape global alliances, diminishing U.S. influence and solidifying China's position as a global leader. China's embrace of self-powered technology is a calculated gamble, but one with potentially enormous payoffs. If successful, it could propel China to the forefront of the global economy, leaving the US struggling to catch up in a world rapidly transitioning to a new energy paradigm.